everybody. I'm Matt. I'm Annabelle. And we're coming at you from Powder 7 here in Golden, Colorado. We're introducing Powder 7's top picks for best backcountry skis of 2021. It's a great year to get into the backcountry, provided you do it safely. Um, and so we've got a lot of skis here that are awesome for earning your turns. So Annabelle and I are going to talk you through four of our favorite backcountry skis for this season. Take it away. Yeah. So my first pick is the Black Rose Camox Freebird going to come in at a 96 underfoot and what's really great about this ski is it comes in as short as a 160 length. Um, also is going to have rocker in the tip and tail. The ski is very maneuverable through the trees, handles a variety of snow conditions, something you can ski inbounds and out with no issues. Heck yeah. Uh, my first pick over here is from Kessley. It's the TX 103, brand new for 2021. Um, past versions of the TX uh, have really been loved by ski mountaineers, people who are hunting big lines late in the spring, big long days, because they're super light and strong with a lot of camber, reliable when you're on at the top of puckering lines. Um, so Kessley kind of spun off of that design to make a little more of an everyday touring ski, especially for Colorado. And whether you're skinning um, at like Bertha Pass or Loveland Pass and linking low angle meadows, or you're going further to find hidden stashes, TX-103 can do all that. A little more rocker than previous TXs, especially in the tail. Uh, helps it surf more. Honestly helps you enjoy the downhill more, in my opinion, than other past versions of the TX. Um, fun fact about this ski too, uh, the tips glow in the dark. I've been told this for 15 minutes. I haven't gotten an Alpine start yet to, to put that to the test, but um, kind of emphasizes that Kessley's really taken the TX line in a fun direction with an everyday touring ski. This is a great pick if you're gonna earn your turns this year. Something I'm exceptionally excited about for this season is gonna be the DPS Pagoda Tour 106 C2. Uh, what they've done here, they've replaced the old Tour 1 construction um, with this new guy. It's gonna be carbon laminate, light wood core, aerospace foam. Makes this ski super light. You could skin all day long, not even break a sweat. Uh, what's even better about it, it comes in as short as a 155 length. That means everyone's going to be able to get their hands on this guy. That 106 underfoot, in my mind, perfect ski for all mountain Colorado skiing. All right, groovy. So the last backcountry ski we're talking about tonight is not actually just a backcountry ski. It's more of a crossover option, a lightweight free ride ski from Vocal, and it's called the Blaze. So this is a new series of skis. There's a men's side and a women's side. They're the same skis with different top sheet colors. This is the 106, and they also make a 94, a little bit narrower underfoot. And these skis ski inbounds very well, probably just as well as your favorite all-mountain ski, um, but they have uh, shed a lot of weight, so you can fly up the skin track on these, um, tour all day, and then maximize your descent. You've got some rubber inserts in the tips to uh, dampen vibrations, absorb some of that shock when you hit some uh, chopped up snow in the backcountry. You can hit a lot of crust and stuff like that. Um, so the advantage of hauling a little bit more weight when you go skinning is when you get to the downhill part, the fun part, uh, you get a little bit more of a capable ski. And the Blaze is absolutely that. Uh, so it's great to pair with a hybrid crossover touring binding like the Solomon Shift or the Marker Duke PT uh, and corresponding boots. There are tons of models of those um, products out there today. And all those would pair really well with the Blaze. So if you're looking for more of a ski where you can buy one ski for all your touring and resort needs, um, I would put the Blaze at the top of your list for 2021. Thanks for tuning in and watching. These were some of our favorite backcountry skis for 2021 season. Really hope you guys go out and enjoy the backcountry this year. Just make sure you're staying safe.